Hey guys, it's pouring rain yet again, but we are going into the Dollar Tree in Baldwin. This is a huge Dollar Tree and I usually end up finding something I didn't even know existed in this store. Plus they have brand name bread. So I'm parking the car and we're running in because it is pouring rain and I don't want to get sick all over again. Oh my goodness, you guys. We are at the Baldwin store and there is so much good stuff here today. So much good new goodness. We have these kitchen towels. It says heavier weight. They are microfiber, not cotton, but they are gorgeous. They really are really pretty and they do match those new pillows that the Dollar Tree made. Even though kitchens and pillows don't necessarily mix, they match. This one says North Pole Tree Farm Christmas Trees This Way, um, but there's no arrow. I guess you got to follow the truck. And then this one says North Pole Bed and Breakfast. This is so cute. Hot cocoa served here. It's so cute, guys. And the buffalo check is so cute. And Baldwin also has the pot holders. And both of them in the back are gray. These are really, really nice. They've also brought in their six pack of cookie cutters that they make every year, including gingerbread men, my favorite. These are really cool. They have a snowman, a Christmas tree, star, gingerbread man, and a gift package. Very, very nice. And we saw these last week, but I'm gonna share them one more time because they are really lovely airtight containers. And this one was sold out the last time I shared these. So I assume that they had discontinued this one, but they didn't. They remade all four from last year again, and these are wonderful. This one says, may your heart be filled with the joy of the season. I love it. And the point set is, this one says, gnome for the holidays, baking spirits bright. And this one just has snowflakes all over it, but they're so good, good, good. And I shared these smaller two pack of storage containers last week, but now I'm also seeing the larger ones with a little handle. You can put chocolates, cookies, anything in here. And this one says, merry and bright, covered in candy canes. And that one has the snowflakes. Those are all really great. And oh, wow, look at this, you guys. These are different baking dishes. I did see these last week, but I'm seeing tons of baking dishes. There's lots to choose from. Guys, this is just getting crazy. We did see these little, um, bread pan baking dishes last week, as well as the ramekin, the little round one. One says baking spirits bright, and the other says warm wishes with the gingerbread men, but this color is off. It's not the same, doesn't really match. But now, get this, these are also off-white, and this one says Merry Christmas. These are brand new, and this one says Merry and Bright. And then look at these little round ones. They don't have anything on the outside. They're printed on the inside. This one says, ho, 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 you can bake in it. This one with the gnome says, happy holidays. And that is really so, so cute. And then check this out. Mrs. Claus looks really hot. Doesn't she look like a really attractive Mrs. Claus? And then we have a super cute elf and it says joy. And two of them have red tipping and two of them have green tipping. These have no tipping and nothing on the inside. These are printed on the outside. There's so many to choose from, it's hard to decide. Then they also brought in their baking cooking cups. You get 100 of the minis or 50 of the larger paper ones. Then they have the candy cane one as well as the minis again. And then this one is really pretty, like folk art looking snowflake. I love this one. They also have the minis for this print as well. So there are three different prints and two different styles to choose from. And once again, Dollar Tree is giving us a lot of choices. That's a good deal for $1.25. They brought back their little burlap gift bags, merry and bright. And then this one has Christmas trees. The print is really nice. I really dig that. And then this one has snowflakes. Yeah, those are super cute. Definitely love those. Three fabric bags for gifting for $1.25 is a great deal. All sorts of fun and festive headbands and even like this, like a head wrap. 
They have these. They have these cute little sparkly ones. They've had these before. These are really funny with the springs and the trees. And these, oh, these are a little different than last year's. These are so cute. And then we have this classic elf headband. They make it every year in the predominantly green or the predominantly red. And the princess headband and of course their fun velvety red scarves with the white pom-poms. And the kids hats, the licensed hats, Spider-Man, Minnie Mouse, Minions. They have the Avengers. Oh, the Mandalorian, Mickey Mouse, Paw Patrol, and Peppa Pig. And they have these festive snowflake ones, really fun. And they also brought in their Tupperware. Look at the gingerbread man one, I really like it. This one says winter wishes. And then we have these, this one has the reindeer on it. And this one says merry and bright. These are up really, really high, but I'm just gonna try really hard to share them with you. And then we have the snowflake ones. They also brought these back, the Baking Spirits Bright, Save Some Cookies for Santa, and Gnome for the Holidays. And those of you who know me know that I love, absolutely love these. They're like my family's Tupperware. These are great for making gift baskets, the fresh cut trees. It's a really big little bin and really nicely decorated on all four sides. And they also brought back their Baking Spirits Bright, it is printed on all four sides as well and also makes a great gift basket. Okay, I don't know if this has been around and I've just never noticed it, but I'm about to freak out. Look at how nice these are. They're six inches by 10 inches. They are already self-adhesive, so you don't even need glue unless you wanna add your own to them. So they're like stickers and they're ombre effect. Look at that, you guys. Can you just see how gorgeous these are? Wow, where was this during the summer? Oh my goodness, this is like the beach. I love it. But this is giving me fall vibes. So beautiful. And look at this. This is perfect for like blinging out stuff at a sweet 16. There are no two that are exactly alike. They really are random and gorgeous. I'm in love with these. Oh my goodness, you guys. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? I can't anymore. Dollar Tree is killing me. Not only did they update their cobblestone corners miniatures of course they light up and i shared that with you guys already those are down here but now their fairy garden stuff takes batteries and lights up this year's fairy garden pieces are killer they're beautiful look at this look at this you guys look at this look at all of the goodness that is here look at this cute train Oh my God, the train could be pulling the sled. There's a red truck. There's a gnome driving a tractor. Look at the cardinal. Oh my goodness. At $1.25, it is a little steep for these little pieces, but you can even order this whole collection online and just have it delivered right to your door. They have fairy garden figures, elves. I wish they had gingerbread men. Where are the gingerbread men? Look at these gnomes, they're super cute. And then look at these little pieces. There are so many awesome pieces to this collection. It's gonna blow your mind. They also have these little snowmen miniatures, little mice. There are so many cute, cute things, guys. It's crazy. Yeah, this is definitely the biggest collection I've ever seen, but I'm not seeing any gingerbread men, which is really a bummer, but I'm totally loving everything else about it. This house has a pink roof and it would go so cute with all of these purple and pink little additions. The welcome arch to your little community. They do have clock tower, so cute. I, I really love this piece, but you guys know that I just love all things gingerbread looking. I mean, they're all so darn cute and they're battery operated. This is incredible, guys. What a nice gift to buy someone. Okay guys, I picked up every single one of these houses for you guys, as well as the welcome sign for the little community, a pack of the holiday fairy garden gnomes, a train, a red truck, and, and a gnome driving a tractor, because who doesn't want that at Christmas time? 
and I'm going to be letting you guys know how you can win this giveaway by the end of this video. Those are the items I'm picking up for me. These are all for you guys. They brought back their premium pure cane light brown sugar, and this is great by Domino's for all of your Thanksgiving baking. Of course, sweet potatoes are just never the same without some light brown sugar. For a buck and a quarter, I'm definitely gonna grab this. Okay, Dollar Tree is really, really just driving me crazy now. I found this, it seems to be new. Things have been disappearing very quickly. Um, it is sealed actually, BSN Lip Balm Stain. This is like a 99 cent store brand. I don't know what it's doing here. It is 08 Night Out. This sells in like our mom and pop dollar stores, this brand. I've never seen it in the Dollar Tree, but they have this here now. And uh, yeah, it's a black lip stain. That would be good for Halloween. We've seen this power stick product before. It's a roll-on that's aluminum free and it is timber musk scented, has a really nice scent and I've actually already tried it. But now this one is specifically labeled for her. It says beauty and skincare power stick and it is pH balanced roll-on antiperspirant deodorant with powder fresh scent. It's not aluminum free and the packaging is actually super cute. It has butterflies, it's really pretty. And yeah, this is new here. Okay guys, these solar lights are back and they seem to be made better than they've been made in the past. I buy these every year and I love them. They are so nice to hang outdoors. They light up, you don't have to plug them in. They come in yellow, red, green, and blue. These are fabulous. But now this I've never seen before. This is new to the Dollar Tree this year and these are really elegant. The light shines into this lucite bubbly. This is fabulous looking and they come in green and red and these are gonna sell out fast, guys. Grab these while you can. Oh my God, you guys, these are the greatest thing the Dollar Tree has ever made. Not only are they solar powered lights that are super elegant, but they are color changing. How absolutely gorgeous are these? Add these to your wish list right now, guys. They're amazing. These are back again. And the Elf on the Shelf lip balm, they all have the little hat on top of them. There are two rows of the candy cane flavored Elf on the Shelf. Then we have Frosty the Snowman, which is frosted berry scented. The Peanuts is also candy cane flavored and Minions is candy cane scented as well. Some of them say scented and some of them say flavored. So there's that, but yeah, these are back and they're super popular at Christmas. Perfect stocking stuffers. They do have some new of the four packs of disposable coffee cups that the Dollar Tree always carries, but these paper disposable cups have new prints. There's this really plain, geometric print and then this one says good coffee and good vibes on the bottom and it has the geometric print on the top and they all have the little um, cardboard so you don't burn your hands and this super cute kind of retro print says every day is coffee day at, and then it says good coffee good vibes someone say coffee question mark those are really cute and then they have blank ones I feel like that's kind of exciting and probably DIY them or embellish them do whatever you want with them and have fun uh, personalized disposable cups in your coffee bar for the Christmas season those are gonna end up getting DIY and grabbed up I have a feeling but yeah these are new at the Dollar Tree check these out guys these are like stemless mimosa glasses or champagne glasses stemless so you don't have to worry about breaking them that easily they're Christar they're much thicker glass than the usual Dollar Tree glass and this one says cheers on both sides these are really nice quality and this one says party these would be great for a New Year celebration I'm also seeing these gold tipped mugs there was a dish set last year that had the gold tipping um, not the snowflake one, but another one. These are super old-fashioned classic looking mugs and They have tons of them here in this Dollar Tree They have cases of them in fact and they also have brought in these mugs and these mugs if you look at the top They're not round. They're like square 
wish I could really convey it. Do you guys see the little corners? But they are very sleek, and they also have this really pointy sort of angle to their handle. Yeah, these are kind of nice, guys, and that's new as well. These are also by Crystar. They're heavy-duty glass. They say Happy Holidays, double-sided with the gnomes. Those are actually really nice glasses and I'm just walking around with my solar lights and I'm starting to get into the Christmas spirit, guys. These are seriously elegant, you guys. Definitely, gr do you guys see what is happening here? I pulled the tab and they are shining and changing color. So bright, these are fantastic. Absolutely will be gone before you know it. Grab them while you can. Look at how cute this is, you guys. It is by LA Colors, and it is called Out and About. But unfortunately, just as I was about to record this, a lady came right up to this and grabbed, she grabbed all that was here. It was strawberry, but they do have coconut, grape, orange, and look at that. The packaging is really nice. Mint, which is my favorite, and pineapple, which sounds kind of good. Then they have this pout potion, and it is a scented lip balm, but the, again, the packaging is really cute. It comes in strawberry, watermelon, lemon. Oh, you don't often see lemon lip balm. That sounds good. Mango, coconut, and grape. And look, it's like a rainbow of colors. I love that. And then we have, I was gonna say that we have lip oil again, but this lip oil magically tints your lips pink. As a matter of fact, all of them do, including the strawberry that is now gone because the lady grabbed each and every one of them. So in this row here, we also have scented lip gloss. This is lip oil that magically turns your lips pink, it says. But this one is scented lip gloss that has vitamin E and mineral oil in it. And um, it comes in strawberry, watermelon, grape, orange, mint, and coconut. And they've made these before. I really liked these retro roller balls. They were super cute. So this right here is new. I've never seen this pout potion before. They have made the roller balls before, um, but this, I've never seen this before either. And they definitely say new. These are little tins. Do you guys remember these? They're so retro. It comes in watermelon, strawberry, grape and peach i mean these take me back for real so these roller balls and the little lip tins that is definitely a trip down memory lane isn't that awesome okay there's a lot of new stuff on the shelves but when you really look a little deeper into it slightly slightly variance in the shading but mostly it seems to be a package change in the LA colors. It does claim to be cruelty free right off the bat, right on the packaging. The new packaging states it proudly, which I do like, and I don't know what the deal was before. That's the old packaging. This is the new packaging, and it says right there that it is cruelty free and vegan friendly. That is very cool. They're very popular lip shine duos have been slightly changed in color. This is Vibe now and this was vibe then there definitely is a slight color difference so if you really love this shade you're gonna have to see if the color is something that you still like or maybe you like it even more their names are the same flushed charmed they're all the same names oh yeah see this is the old packaging here flushed and flushed let's compare them they actually even have the same number, but they are, again, a slightly different color. That is really interesting. Journal is way, way brighter than it used to be, and so is Vibe. Definitely very 80s, and I don't know if I remember ever seeing this one in the old line. It's called Twinkle. It's almost like a clear sort of nude color. Oh, this is really nice. This lipstick is called New and Improved Victory, but I don't think I remember them having this hydrating color before. They have Victory, they have Sorbet, they have Natural Shine, Take It Easy, 
Big Deal, Dusty Rose, which is like a pretty mauve. Oh, and they also have this one called Bright Pink. And this one is called Dear Love. That's a really pretty color. They used to have one that was more red and I'm not seeing it. Perhaps they have discontinued that one. Now this one is called Clarity, which is really just totally sheer in comparison to Twinkle. So yeah, they definitely didn't have two lipsticks like this before and these are both new, the new and improved look. I'm also seeing eyeliner brow pencils, new packaging for their mascara that also says that it's paraben free. I don't think I've ever seen that before. So perhaps that's the improvement. Now this is interesting. It says lengthening mascara. I don't remember ever, ever seeing this. So I'm curious to see if this is a completely new product. They have brow pencils with the spoolie. They have it in black, soft brown and it comes in dark brown. It actually even comes in medium brown, so there's three browns. That's sort of cool as well. They're Supernatural, it has the same name, different packaging, maybe slightly different colors, but honestly, they're 12, honestly, their 12 color palettes are not my favorite. They are not that pigmented. I find that the less colors that you get in the LA Colors palettes, the better they are. Although I do have this urban one, the colors are very similar. Um, and the nude as well, very similar. All of them are really similar. I find that the three, my favorite ones are the three pan ones and the two pan ones. I think that those have the best pigment. Bang for your buck. This one is really pretty. Its name is Tumbleweed. It's definitely got a new name. I don't remember that in the old one. Well. Actually, I do remember Iris in the old three pan eyeshadows. It's very complicated. Yeah, they look like they're the same, but new packaging. And I remember Water Lily as well. Not sure if they had the Desert Rose before. I know that I've tried this and tested it. They do look to be very similar to the old ones, but I have to say that the new six pan palettes are very nicely packaged really really beautiful packaging because each each container complements the eyeshadows beautifully so these are nice gifts they have the same names as before i own this lucky palette almost nude yeah these are all the same names as before new packaging but maybe slight this is brighter than the other one so maybe they really did improve them and we do have some new lip balms from Remy Cosmetics. We have Peppermint and Sugar Cookie, and those are excellent stocking stuffers. I think it's most obvious in this change. Now, this makeup stick happens to be a late addition that they added to their collection just a few months ago, and it came in on its own, Pink Satin. And Pink Satin bears the same number. Look at the color difference. So really, a lot of these bear the same name, but they are definitely different. If you have become accustomed to something specific, you're gonna to have to go to your Dollar Tree and check out the new packaging and the new shades. I will say that the new color for this makeup stick is really nice. I do like the three-in-one. It's really nice, definitely as eyeshadow, but I think I'm gonna like this one even more. I see these new makeup bags, Primpin' Ain't Easy, and they're cotton, and I really like them. They are heavy-duty cotton, not printed on both sides, but that's okay. They are part of the Sassy and Chic line. These are really nice quality. This, you guys, this is definitely a hidden gem. We did see the Kendall and Kylie makeup bags, and they're nice, and they were expensive before they made it to the Dollar Tree, but I'll tell you right now, these makeup bags are heavy-duty faux leather, really really super cute they fit a ton of items and they are heavy duty and nicely made i am completely loving these and i think that these are a great buy how cute are these for stocking stuffers and gifts really nice I'm really impressed with them and these are actually sassy and chic in all honesty i do sort of love this one even though it's much smaller but i think i love these way more Ooh, guess what guys? Not only did we get new Remy Rose lip balms, but we got new Remy Rose liquid lipsticks. And I love liquid lipstick and I actually quite like 
Remy Rose liquid lipstick. We have Robin, which is this like pinky nude color. Drew, super cute. Cleo, which is like a brown, seems like a matte brown. Then we have Tony. And we also have, oh, when we have this really dark like burgundy shade called Sadie. And I feel like, I actually feel like Sweet Sadie J would like that color. Then we have Tinted Lip Balm. This one is called Skylar, and it's like almost a nude pink sort of color. And this one is pink and it's called Gianna. This one is called Mila, and it is like a burgundy, but remember these are lip balms. And then we have Glitter Lip Toppers. Those are beautiful. I love glitter lip toppers. And this one is called Layla. And this gorgeous one is called B. Then we have the colored lip balm Little Pots. This is the color of this one. And it's called Peyton. I think they've had Peyton before. And we also have Lena. And it's this color. These are actually super cute, very popular. These little colored, these little tub lip balms are very popular. And then they have their lip exfoliator. And actually, that sells out really quickly. People love that. But I think I love, love the glitter lip toppers the most. Interestingly enough, more and more products that are popping into the Dollar Tree are made in Mexico. And it appears that this is a new trend. These are the new Sure and Fresh Feminine Cleansing Cloths for sensitive skin. This one is citrus and tangerine scented. You get 32. And this one is tropical coconut scented, also 32. It says that it has aloe and chamomile alcohol free and it's hypoallergenic. I feel like this packaging looks different. I do see that they are fully restocked so maybe they're I know that they're restocking it I'm not sure if they repackaged it but these are the four piece eye makeup brush set that they had last year looks to be the same they do have the angled brush I just think the packaging might be slightly different I'd have to go home and check but they are in full new stock if you never got them before they have them now and these are actually nice stocking stuffers check this out guys I have been looking for Gildan boxer briefs for maybe two years and it looks like I practically almost missed the boat but I'm happy to see these here they are in a size large that is really exciting for a dollar 25 you get two pairs used to get a lot more but I'll take two thank you this store definitely has some really fabulous books um, and they're always restocking but let me show you some of the cool books that I've noticed here today. This one is called Hubble Stitch Instructions and Inspiration for this creative new lace beadwork technique. Look at that. It's a manual on how to do it. This is so awesome. Wow, I love stuff. Oh my goodness, look at how beautiful. How cool is that? This is really great for someone who already knows how to crochet or is interested in learning how to do beadwork jewelry and you can even sell it on Etsy. And then there's this one, Acrylic Works 5. I don't see 432 or 1, but it says the best of acrylic painting, bold values. This is a really nice hardcover book. This is what it looks like inside. It's really a gorgeous book. It would be a really nice stocking stuffer for the artist in your life. And then there's this book. It's called Ultimate Memory Magic, the transformation program for sharper memory, mental clarity, and greater focus at any age. So it has a series of activities to help you have a better memory. That might be good. Now this is crazy, crazy cool. It is a series called Gifted, Speak No Evil, Gifted, Better Late Than Never. This is great for tweens. And this one is called Finders Keepers. When I look on the back, I realize that I have three out of five in the series. That is pretty awesome. I wonder if the whole collection is in the stores. And do you guys see how it has like, like hidden pictures. The covers are really, really cool, and I bet that tweens will love these books. 
Check this out, guys. Creating personal mandalas, story circle, techniques in watercolor and mixed media. What? This is super cool. Here we go with some more boho fabulousness. You could just gift someone tons of awesome boho objects from the Dollar Tree that look way more expensive. This is a really beautiful book. Look at this fabulousness. It's a whole book devoted to knitting socks. Oh my gosh, that is super cute. Like I said, we're in Baldwin and they do have the awesome level here, the picture hanging and leveling tool, but this one is not the one that I found the other day that has all of the additional accessories, 80 pieces that included screws and anchors and all the goodies. That's the one you really want to find, the box with the white border, but they do have tons of these levels and these are also a really great product, just not the best possible bang for your buck. I've never seen these before, Chuckles Minis. It's a five ounce box for a buck and a quarter. Those look delicious. I may have to try those because you guys know how I love my jelly candy. This store is absolutely stocked in Christmas. Many of the items here we have already seen, but we definitely have not seen all. We saw the tag, but we haven't seen all of the sled signs. Ooh, Santa stops here. Look at how cute that is. That is really pretty. We did see this one, and I do think they had this one last year. I think this is the first that I'm seeing this one. And then, oh yes, we saw, I believe that they had this one out last year as well. Celebrate Christmas together. This is really nice, but this is the first that I'm seeing this one, and it's super cute. I guess that sold out quick. Then I do see this one. Have yourself a Merry Little Christmas with the buffalo check at the top. And we have seen this one. And this one has the plaid on the top. These are just so nice. Then they have the home for the holidays. Really, really nice. And I did see this one and absolutely love it. The magic of Christmas never ends on this super cute train with the glitter. It's so cute. I just love this one. But there is another one. Oh my God, have yourself a merry and magical Christmas. And look, I love when they have the white sparkly glitter. It does look magical, doesn't it? It's really nice. And they also have this one. There's no place like home for the holidays. That's a sweet, sweet sign as well. Two generations by the tree. That is really, really sweet. And these are classic Dollar Tree decor. We have the Let It Snow, Winter Wonderland, Hot Cocoa, Fresh Cut Christmas Trees, Build a Snowman, and Sleigh Rides. So perfect for all sorts of decor. And we also have this one. I think I love it because I love this section here. Oh, it's so cute. Merry Christmas, tis the season, joy to the world. Believe in the magic of Christmas. And look at how beautiful that is. It looks three-dimensional and it's not. Happy holidays and merry and bright. So nice. And check this out, guys. They have monogrammed rugs. My friend Pamela from Pamela's World was the first to pop these out in her video. I have not yet seen them and they are pretty cool. It would be so cool if you had a big space and spelled out something with them. I just think it's really, really nice. They have this pretty print, but they will get dirty really quickly. And then they have this really cute print. I don't know which one I like better. I know this is a W, but maybe I can pass it off as an M. <laughs> but they are really fabulous. Then I'm finally seeing some of my wish list items. These little framed Christmas signs are definitely high end looking. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Absolutely gorgeous. This one says joy to the world. And look at that. Isn't that beautiful? And then we have merry and bright with the teal truck. I don't know which one I like more. I love each and every one of those. These super cute little block, wood block, tabletop decor that you could put um, pictures in. You could put pictures in or even names at the dinner table. Family, love, and home. They're super cute in a trio. Or even maybe you could take 
the wire out and DIY with them. I don't know, but these are really, really nice. And they definitely look like they cost more than $1.25. And each one has this little card in it already that has been attached permanently. Love is all you need, home sweet home, and family is everything. So when you buy it, you'll have to cut it out. But it does make the presentation so much nicer by making sure that these don't fall out. I really like that they did that. Oh my gosh, if you guys are local to this store, you need to come here this weekend. They have so much fun, great wish list items in this store. So many good crafting supplies. I'm just panning over quickly just to share a little bit. Oh, I just love those. They have the larger corks. Um, there's really a lot of stuff here. They have the fun boho pom-poms with all the boho stuff coming into the stores. I'm sure you guys could use these. I've already shared these glass dropper bottles but i have to say i do like that they're here it's a good item to have available but this is new to me you guys it is a paint and water cup isn't that awesome you could even put this in the middle of a table and the whole family could share and mix their paint colors and that is really cool i've never seen anything like that it could be used in schools that's a nice buy for a buck and a quarter Oh my goodness, you guys, are you seeing these? These little jars are made of glass. They're so adorable. They are loaded with 1.05 ounce of rhinestone gems in clear diamond, pink diamond, beautiful blue, and exceptionally gorgeous green. I can't even believe that these are here for a buck and a quarter. They are absolutely beautiful. And the jars, I like even more than the gems. Amazing, amazing item. I can't even, you guys. This store is exploding with fantastic crafters items. Look at this. Jumbo glitter. Look at how beautiful these are. They are so chunky and fun, and I love this color. They come in metallic, beautiful blue, this magenta, silver, and gold. Gorgeous. These bottles are plastic, and they do have the shaker top, but this, you guys, this is just flawlessly incredible looking. And then on top of my absolute favorite, crafting item Dollar Tree has ever made. I am finding foil flakes. Yes. Do you guys see this fabulousness? Crafter Square now has foil flakes in gold foil, rose gold foil, and silver. It is a 0.35 ounce. I don't know if that's a good deal, but I definitely know it's gorgeous. Oh, more new power stick deodorants. This one says beauty and skin care. This one is aluminum free. It's mint and cucumber by Power Stick, 0% uh, alcohol roll-on deodorant. And now this one is Invisible Protection Roll-On Antiperspirant Deodorant. The packaging is black, which would make me think that it's for men, but really it doesn't matter. And it is spring fresh scent. That looks cool. I am done testing out aluminum free deodorants. They just don't work for me. These are by Expressions. They have a rubber grip and it's a really cool looking comb. This would be great for in shower and it's a brand name for $1.25. Hey guys, we're at the Dollar Tree in Levittown, one of my very favorite Dollar Trees. It is a rainy, miserable day, but I have a funny feeling we're gonna find some awesome stuff in the Dollar Tree. I can't wait to see what we find. Oh my goodness, you guys. I am in the back of the Levittown store and their ornaments are out the beautiful owls. I love these owls. Year after year, they make me happy. I even did a DIY wreath with them. That's how much I love them. Ooh, I'm seeing so many awesome things, but did you guys know that they made these beaded ornaments that are personalized? How cool are these? And they also come in black and white, which is pretty cool. I have to say those are cool for farmhouse style but I really love these and I actually found M and C but I can't find J so I'm on the hunt for that. Check out these buffalo plaid ornaments. We've seen these but we've I've never seen this. This is a nice size ornament and it comes in black and white. Check as well. Those are so cool. They have the star. These are really beautiful. I really like them. They, they also have the round one. 
Many of them we've seen in years gone by, but they're back. They brought back the tartan plaid initials. I already have those. They're super duper cute. I love my initial. It's so nice. Fully stocked. They brought these back. They brought these beautiful tags back. These are super gorgeous. Happy holidays. Holly Jolly and Merry Christmas. So pretty. Those are nice to add to a wreath. They're almost like a bow. And then we have the beautiful church that they make every year. It's also gorgeous. And it comes in white up there as well. Look at all of these beautiful glittery ornaments. I love them. We've seen the ballerinas and we have silver bells and you get four bells all together. Each one is two, silver or gold. We have them in gold glitter, silver glitter, shiny gold or shiny silver. Those are super pretty. I'm just gonna pan over everything and give you guys a glimpse. These are ornaments that they have been making year after year, but they are really gorgeous. These are just so, so pretty and high-end looking. I have to say, I do love them. I don't think that they had this snowflake LED light last year. They have a star, the blue bulb, the longer red bulb. They have the round multicolor set and the longer multicolor set. And they have the star set which would be great for 4th of July and for the Christmas, but I really don't remember the snowflake unless I'm losing it, but I don't remember seeing that. And this is what it looks like. It's really pretty. Oh my goodness, you guys, the crafter square section is just, it's just crazy. Look at this now, look at what they made. This is beautiful and it has the beads and it's heavy duty, real wood. We saw these last week and they have the little bites missing on the edge and they're like paneling and these are just absolutely gorgeous. If you saw my haul, then you know that I'm obsessed with them. But now this and this and this and this, I, I can't, you guys, they are killing it. How amazing is that? That is so nice. You can even put a mirror in there. These are all really amazing DIY items. Oh my goodness, the Dollar Tree is making so much warm and fuzzy hair accessory stuff that it's actually making me feel warm and fuzzy. Look at these, you guys. They are actual sweater, sweater weather headbands, and they also have matching scunchies. They're so soft and nice. I don't even wear scunchies and I love these. These are really inviting and just cozy and nice. I really like these. So these look like fabric shower caps. Um, they're not plastic, they're really fat. They come in lavender, pink, and mint green. And they also have eight packs of plastic shower caps. And they brought in some two packs of some thicker shower cap like bonnets. And they have this pattern as well. Okay, so this is crazy. This Pop Fanatic by Flower Beauty in the shade Bang, which is green, is back, you guys. And I do absolutely love this, but I can't help but wonder if this has just been trapped in the stock room for months because this is out in full effect. And if you didn't get it the first time, come grab it now. It's a nice stocking stuffer. These are new, and I have been on the hunt for these super fun, kiss gel polishes these are no uv lamp needed but they are gel like they do have this pink seems to need a lot of shaking it's like a baby pink but then i'm seeing this gorgeous yellow such a beautiful summer color and look at this gorgeous gorgeous orange i love kiss polish and at a dollar 25 it's a steal it may seem silly but i'm really happy to see almond joy back in the dollar tree as well as the twix i haven't seen twix in ages almond joy and they even brought back the kit kat snack size and it's the real chocolate one instead of the white chocolate one these are items that used to be really easy to find in the dollar tree and i haven't seen them in months and months especially the chocolate kit kat that is very exciting 
and the Chips Ahoy Chunky King Size, eight cookies for $1.25. These are convenient grabs and I haven't seen these in ages either. I'm happy to see these are back. They are three ounce bags of non-GMO sun-made raisins, just in time for stuffing and all sorts of exciting pie making. These drop in the Dollar Tree. That's it guys, that's everything I found this week at my Dollar Tree. I hope you guys enjoyed this walkthrough. If you did, please do comment down below on your favorite items and make sure to leave the video a huge thumbs up and even share it with your friends. Maybe they'd like to see what's new in my Dollar Trees. And as always guys, stay safe and stay savvy. Bye-bye.